staying on top of new developments at Metro this morning, a major leadership shakeup. General Manager Paul Wiedefeld abruptly moved up his retirement. Yeah, Metro COO Joe Leader also resigned effective immediately. News 4 Transportation reporter Adam Tuss live at the Greenbelt Metro Station with more. Adam, good morning. Good morning, Jimmy. Good morning, Anya. You just get the sense that it's all starting to come undone here at the end for Paul Wiedefeld and his top managers. He was supposed to retire at the end of June, but now he has retired effective immediately. And take a look. Of course, Paul Wiedefeld has been under some scrutiny since that 7,000 series derailment issue back in October. Uh, he's been dealing with a lot of questions about who knew what and when. And then fast forward to what was going on yesterday when we hear that a number of Metro train operators have not received the proper safety training. You get the sense that the screws started to be tightened. Even D.C. Mayor Muriel Bowser weighing in on what she thought was a preventable situation. Take a listen to what she had to say about everything yesterday. I was pretty taken aback by it, quite frankly. I think Metro is on the path to its recovery. People are going back to the rail. Uh, people are, are, have increasingly been using the bus. I think they're making very good progress on the rail cars. Um, and so this just seems like an administrative uh, problem that should have been avoided. Yeah, you're starting to hear more and more things like that. Okay, so Paul Wiedefeld and Joe Leader out, the top two leaders at the transit agency. What happens now? Well, Metro actually had to appoint an interim general manager. His name is Andy Off. He's been with the transit agency for some time. So for all intents and purposes, he's the general manager right now before Randy Clark can come in. And we still don't have a start date for him. So Metro guys very much this morning, a transit agency in turmoil in terms of its leadership and riders still facing delays and wondering when these new rail cars are coming back. A lot to really sift through here uh, as we pick up the pieces from the transit agency, guys. Yeah, a lot of work for that new GM when he gets oh, to town this summer. Gracious. Yeah. Adam Tuss, <laughs> live for us. Thank you.